hey guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to a brand new video um today we're gonna be talking about uh what's going on in the world um what's going on in my life um everything everything is just happening um especially everything with uh COVID-19 and um probably one of the weirdest things that happened throughout my lifespan um and there's been some weird stuff but I think this tops it as the weirdest thing in general as like top of weird things and like I said there's been a lot but I'm here to tell you some tricks and tips and some stuff that you can do to pass the time um, of being stuck in a house like me for the past three weeks. Um, and trust me, I know how you feel. It's, it's, it's not normal being out of your normal routine, going places, going to school, and doing this and doing that. But, um, as long as you're staying home, you're keeping social distance away from people, um, washing your hands, don't do what I just did. I had an itch in my nose and I just touched my face. It's too much of a habit. I can't control myself. But, um, so yeah, I'm gonna talk to you about some stuff and we're gonna get right into the video. So, um, as always, make sure you drop a like on the video, show your support. As always, subscribe, we're on the road to 100. Um, I see some of you that are watching my videos aren't subscribed. So, if y'all could subscribe to the channel and help me out through this journey, um, through everything that's going on right now, it'd be greatly appreciated. Without further ado, let's get right into the video. First up, um, you always, whether you're stuck at home or you just, in general, I mean, you should be doing this on a daily basis, but, you know, you're stuck at home and there's nothing to do. What do you want to do? You want to, you're sitting back and you're snacking, you're snacking all day. You need to control how you eat throughout all this because you're sitting at home and you're not really getting too much exercise. Maybe you're going outside doing a little bit, a little bit of this, but you're not on your daily commute. You're not moving around. You need to control what you eat during all this because it could be a big factor when everything's done and you're not healthy. So the big thing is to stay healthy and going on with that, as I just said, make sure you do some kind of exercise a day whether it's just staying inside and doing a little bit of exercise a day or you just can go outside and um like if you live in a the private area i guess you could say or you have your own little backyard area go outside do something exercise um do all you can do and um do some push-ups, some pull-ups, you know, something to keep you mobile and something to keep you from just sitting in your house all day. See me, I just go play basketball or I go walk, you know, I live in a kind of a private area between a bunch of people, so like, like I did the video last week of me walking, I do that on a daily basis because it keeps me mobile and it keeps, keeps me to where... I'm not just sitting in this house and doing nothing. So that's it on that subject. Um, going along with that, um, just don't just don't stay inside. Don't like stay inside, but keep it to where. 
people, you don't have to touch people to do anything. Go outside in your own place, in your own time, do your own stuff, and just... I pray that this will be over soon, I guess. But, for the time being, you gotta do what you gotta do. And, that's all we can do. Now, next up, um, is something opposite of what I just said. You get bored. You got games. Um, not just <clears throat> your normal Xbox, PlayStation, Nintendo Switch, your phone playing games on it. <clears throat> Yeah, that stuff counts, but in addition to watching TV and watching videos on your phone and some other stuff, play some board games, some Uno if you have a brother or sister, <clears throat> and enjoy the time that you have to spend with them because you're at home and you're not really doing it anyways, and more than likely, if you're home you're probably somebody that goes to school or uh in a job that that uh just cut you off of work so what you can do is you can spend time you can play cards um <clears throat> if you got that xbox playstation hook up multiplayer if you're one of them people like i know <clears throat> you want to destroy the hell out of your kid in call of duty that's perfectly fine, I guess. I don't know. Y'all, just do something that can get your mind off of everything. Watch some TV. Don't watch the news. I have heard people saying, oh, the best way to get rid of it is to just clear your mind. No, the best, part, the best way to get your mind off of everything that's going on right now is to not watch the news. Watch something other than the news because the news is just going to keep reminding you of everything that's going on in the world. And it's just a bunch of cluster that you don't need on yourself. And it causes a lot of anxiety on yourself about what is going to happen tomorrow or the next day. And you're just getting that worry. It's like, well, will I get it? Will my family get it? Will I lose somebody because of it? The best way is to not watch the news don't freak out about it don't get anxiety about it or get crazy about it just because you're stuck in a house like me for about a month now and it's just crazy it's a it's a it's a bunch of crazy stuff that we're not used to on a daily basis and you just got to get used to it for a little bit and pray this will be all over with and the next thing that i want to talk about um your hands and your hygiene is probably um, the most most important thing that you can do as a person um, to keep your well-being to where you will be okay. Um, you know, uh, washing your hands, using Germex if you could find some. Uh, Guys, we need Germex, not toilet paper. I don't know what the hell y'all doing in the damn grocery stores, but y'all crazy people and save some for the rest of us. Jesus Christ. Um, that's why we got red beans. We just stocked up on some red beans in this house. Oh, Lord. Like I said, people be like, we need toilet paper, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, you need toilet paper. Look at all them beans we stopping up on. Anyway, uh, your personal hygiene is probably one of the better things that you have to, uh, or one of the most important things through all this you have to worry about. You know, keep your hands washed. Um, some of y'all nasty people, y'all need to take a shower. You know who I'm talking about. I'm not pointing at anybody, but you know who I'm talking about. You need to take a shower. Because if you don't take a shower, you gonna stink. Don't think just because you stuck up in this house, you ain't gotta take a shower. Your parents gonna come home. What you smelling all raunchy for? 
and take your butt in your bathroom. <laughs> Guys, I can't control myself sometimes. But, <coughs> oh Lord, that Jesus is calling me. <coughs> oh Lord, I'm joking. At least I hope. The next thing that, um, Things about I'm like controlling a pattern here, and I just realized I'm like the last two times maybe I've said the next next thing like yeah that's the next thing it's continuous though but um if you get to watching some TV um Netflix Hulu Disney Plus whatever it is not sponsored um. But you know, you want to sponsor. Anyways, um, to pass the time, find you a series to watch. Find you a movie that um, entertains you, that interests you, and I don't know why I just did that. Uh, <laughs> um, listen to some music that you want to listen to. Find somebody through all this that that sings that has a meaning or something that maybe you can as a person relate to and why do I have like an alfalfa bottom hair like right here and it's just it's just chill and I feel like you know avatar how he's got the little thing in his head one little piece that's sticking <laughs> yeah Ain't no haircut place been open, so I can't go get a haircut because nobody wants to cut my hair. I'm gonna look like freaking, um, I don't even know. My hair's just getting long. I don't usually let it get this long. I usually cut it by now, but I haven't been able to go nowhere to get it cut. So... Guys, it's just a lot going on. That's going to wrap up today's video. I'd like to thank all y'all for watching. My hair is still a mess. <laughs> I just made it worse. Um, thank you guys all for watching. Um, if you're like me and you're uh, doing something unique, creative, and um, while you're stuck at home, drop it in the comments. Let me know what you're doing. What is on my chin? I don't know. Let me know in the comments what you're doing and what you've been doing while you've been stuck home. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it for today's video. Make sure you like it. Make sure you smash that like button on the video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel once again on the Road to 100 uh, subscribers, which whoo, we need to get there. We need to get there fast. Uh, so if you could just do that and get, help me out a lot, um, because half the people that are watching my videos aren't subscribed. Um, so if you could do that, be a lot. Thank you uh, for watching once again, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Remember, do what you love. Peace.